commercials. Uh, we're so proud to bring you this show on a weekly basis, but please support all our local sponsors. Uh, they're the heart and soul of uh, why we're on the air. We thank our new sponsor, Jewelry by Stephen, the Kasner Real Estate Group, best real estate in uh, all of uh, New York. All creatures want, all creatures. If you love pets, they love their pets. The Institution of Long Beach, been in business 99 years, Shines Bar. Hub Billions of Island Park, where we were last week. Coco Fitness, you want to get uh, in good shape, they have a 30-minute program. Taco Tuesday at the Cabana. It's uh, standing room only. And Walter and I know this place very well. Walter and I both had a uh, fender bender. We're both going to West End Chiropractic and getting great treatment from Jeff Stanger. All right, Jeff Stanger! And uh, West End Chiropractic, of course. Bikram Yoga, and uh, we have great sponsors. And coming on board, uh, we just uh, got a verbal commitment. The Peter Grill is coming on board, and Wendy at the Five Star Salon. And Five Star Salon is located right next to Jewelry by Stephen. But also, there is, everybody said, you know, what is missing in the West End? What is lacking in the West End? What does the East End have that the West End doesn't have? A burger place! That lacking problem is out the window. Because right now, in the last several weeks, the West End has its very own burger place. It's called Jake's Wayback Burgers. It's awesome. Let's get off a job from Jake's Wayback Burgers. <laughs>
Now, Jerry Romanoff, you're very involved in, in everything that goes on in the West End. And uh, before the show, you had some interesting comments about Jake's Wayback Burgers. Why don't you share it with our listening audience? Uh, the first time I met John was at the West End uh, Neighbors Civic Association. And he made, a, he made a, a presentation of what he was going to do. And a lot of people were questioning whether he can do what he said. He said, it's going to be family, it's going to be bicycles. Going to come locally, and uh, I went in there with my wife, and it just opened up. And guess what? They had kids uh, at one table, young kids, they had teenagers, they had uh, families that had a huge amount of bicycles outside, uh, and we just got such a thrill watching the families enjoying uh, the, the burgers and the shakes. And uh, whatever John said, it came absolutely true, and uh, we're thrilled to have him, and I can't wait to go back. And you know, you're right. I still have that milkshake here that I had that night. <laughs> That's awesome. That's awesome. And uh, a, 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 a report that we're going to start uh, this week. Um, people in Long Beach are passionate about a lot of things. They're passionate about music. They're passionate about food and their bars. They're passionate about beach volleyball. But one thing they're passionate about that is all year round is surfing. And Quicksilver was here. The surfing was incredible. The waves were incredible. Put Long Beach on the map, and to do our weekly surfing report, he's a member of the Long Beach surfing team. Let's give it up for Jake Alexander. <laughs> All right, hey up? I'm gonna start on Wednesday. So tomorrow, the, looks like the waves are gonna be one foot. It's 100 percent guaranteed. The highest wind is gonna be 21 miles per hour. Uh, Thursday, it looks like it's gonna be three foot. All Schaefer. I am. 